understanding, daydream believer, an insight into English idioms. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase in the English language, daydream believer. This phrase is not just a collection of words, but a portal into the rich and colorful world of English idioms and expressions. Let's embark on this linguistic journey together and discover the depths of what it means to be a daydream believer. Daydream believer is an intriguing phrase composed of two key words, daydream and believer. A daydream is a series of pleasant thoughts that distract one's attention from the present, often leading to a world of imagination or fantasy. It's like a mini escape from reality. A believer, on the other hand, is someone who has confidence in the truth or existence of something. So, when these two words come together, they paint the picture of a person who not only daydreams but also deeply believes in the possibility of their daydreams. This phrase gained popularity from a hit song titled, Daydream Believer, by The Monkees, released in 1967. It's more than just a line in a song, it represents a certain optimism and hopeful outlook on life. A daydream believer is often seen as someone who is positively hopeful, dreaming of a better situation or future, despite the possibly unrealistic nature of these dreams. In everyday English, calling someone a daydream believer can have both a positive and a negative connotation, depending on the context. Positively, it can refer to someone with a hopeful and imaginative spirit. Negatively, it might imply that someone is not being realistic or practical, lost in their fanciful thoughts. It's important to understand the context to interpret the meaning correctly. Metaphorically, being a daydream believer can symbolize the human tendency to hope and aspire for things beyond our immediate reality. It reflects the power of the human mind to transcend the mundane aspects of daily life and dream of something more, something extraordinary. This phrase encourages us to appreciate the dreamers among us, those who dare to imagine and believe in possibilities. I hope this exploration of daydream believer has been enlightening and enjoyable. This phrase is a beautiful example of how the English language can capture complex ideas and emotions in just a few words. Remember, language is not just about grammar and vocabulary, it's also about culture, emotion, and imagination. Keep dreaming and believing, and until next time, happy learning!